Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toyota located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this 2018 Toyota 4Runner Limited. Now the most notable features on this Limited is its heated and cooled front seats. You also have your navigation system and your parking sensors. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this 2018 Toyota 4Runner Limited. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this Limited is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lamps and then if you take a closer look just in the center of the grille you'll see your block heater along with your parking sensors and over on the side you have your 20 inch aluminum alloy wheels. Now taking a look up top you have your integrated signal lamps as well as your foldable mirrors, heated mirrors, vortex generators. And you also have the smart key system with it. So with the smart key system, you can lock all the doors simultaneously just by pushing on the two little lines you see there on the handle. Push it on once, it'll lock all the doors automatically. And then if you put your hand between the handle, it'll unlock the front door for you as well. Now this is all possible just as long as you do keep the key fob on you at all times. And the color we're going to be taking a look at today is white. Now to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you have your black leather interior seat surfaces with your power driver's seat with lumbar support. Taking a look just over on your left hand side you have your mirror controls, your parking sensors on and off, window wiper de-icer and your on and off switch for your rear cargo power outlet. On the inside of your driver's side door you have your window locks, power locks, window controls both your front and rear windows along with your seat memory controls. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your scroll function, mode select, volume control, Bluetooth, voice recognition display, and cruise control. Now you do have the push button start, so all you have to do is push your foot on the brake, hit the push button, and it will start up for you automatically. Now taking a look at the touch uh, multi-informational display, you'll see a couple of different options, which include a speedometer. You can also go through and take a look at a couple of other additional features with your average fuel economy. And taking a look down at the bottom of the screen there, you'll see a digital compass as well as an exterior temperature gauge. And taking a closer look now, you have at your center dash your digital clock, hazard lights, and then inside your apps menu, you'll see your navigation audio phone as well as a couple of other additional features on your touch panel display. You do have that premium JBL sound system with your XM satellite radio. Dual zone climate control settings, USB and auxiliary input with your power outlets, heated and cooled front seat controls for your driver and passenger, 4x4 select, matted to a automatic transmission with your open and close for your power rear window. Up at top here, you have your auto dimming rear view mirror and a couple of the controls you'll see include your integrated garage door opener, traction control on off, a track down the hill control, and your open and close as well as your tilt up and down feature for your power moonroof. Now when you throw this into reverse here, I'm just going to show you what your backup camera looks like. As you can see, you have those nice guiding lines in there making things much easier for you when you try to back into a stall. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate now located on your rear bumper. You're going to see your parking sensors just located right across. On the back of the tailgate, you'll find your backup camera just on your left hand side as well as your rear hatch leaves located underneath your 4Runner emblem. Now I'm just going to close in on the rear cargo space just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now if you do need some more additional space you can actually fold down that second row seating just in case you need to move a couple of things. You have a 50-50 split for your third row so if you want to fold them up just pull on that middle piece there. It will fold the seats right up for you. And if you take a look just over on your right hand side you're going to see that rear cargo power outlet so in the event that you're ever out at the cabin or the lake during the weekend you need to plug in your tools you can do so or if you'd like, you can plug in a mini fridge or a couple of speakers. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions on this 2018 Toyota 4Runner Limited, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. The phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comments section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day, and I hope to see you next time.